name is Dan, and I've been working on adding Oculus Rift DK2 support to Prepare 3D. Prepare 3D is a flight simulator by Lockheed Martin based upon what was originally Microsoft Flight Simulator X. Although Prepare 3D is commercial software and not intended for entertainment use, you can purchase a developer license for only $10 per month if you intend on developing plugins for it. You don't need to be a commercial developer, you can just be a hobbyist, and there's no verification required. So far I've added support for full positional head tracking and chromatic aberration correction, and as long as you maintain 75 frames per second, it is a very comfortable and immersive experience. I've added support for the clickable cockpit and integrated the ability to view the kneeboard as part of the cockpit. Over time, I plan to enhance kneeboard support so that you can pull up any document or website you want and view it inside your cockpit while flying. That way you can view your VFR sectionals, your GPS, any software you really want, all without coming out of the rift. Right now, my plugin is still alpha level. It only renders to a 1920 by 1080 back buffer, meaning the display isn't as crisp as it could be, and time warp isn't supported yet. That said, as long as you maintain 75 frames per second, there is no noticeable lag. Maintaining 75 frames per second in Prepare 3D isn't easy. I have an i5-3570 and a GeForce 780 Ti. Prepare 3D doesn't tax my graphics card, but it fully utilizes multiple cores in my i5 and is CPU limited. To maintain a smooth frame rate, I have to turn off autogen scenery. The frame rate's also extremely affected by which aircraft you choose to fly. I'm flying the Mall I M7 because it is much lighter on the CPU than the other included aircraft. You'll really have to play with the settings on your own computer. Anyways, feel free to download the plugin from my website. Give it a try, let me know what you think. Enjoy flying!